my goodness gracious welcome everybody all right so i uh last episode we launched a bajillion rockets i think we're up to like seven ish rockets launched somewhere around there seven pressure rockets launched the the idea was basically i want to get the terraforming index to go up as fast as possible so i'm kind of going to be scampering to just launch as many rockets as possible as quickly as possible so that we can hit our numbers because a lot of the progression is just going to be time locked and that's the whole like launch the rockets build the build the drills stuff like that the other thing i wanted to focus on this episode is i want to be getting as many um drills as i can i think the magic number is going to be between eight and ten of each uh resource type Whoa. whether that's drills or whatever's I'm going to try and get probably about 10 of each at all times. I think that'll help. Eight, eight to 10, generally. Um, I think heat, we're up to 10 tier 3 heats. And then tier 2 drills, I think we ended up with like 3. So I need to make more. Have some water, have some food. I do officially have this guy here. My inventory's full. Ooh, not enough. Oh, yeah. Um, put that away. Iron is full. Magnesium. Silicon. Titanium. Ooh, iron. Aluminum is an issue. Okay, give me all the aluminum. Okay. Silicon, magnesium. I think that's enough. Yeah. Iridium rod, titanium. Okay, I need one drill for sure. Even if it's just one tier one drill for sure. Like, let's do it. I think that'll help a lot. We'll just slap down one tier three for aluminum. That way we guaranteed have some aluminum coming in. As well as some basic other resources as well. Oh, look, we have some solar over there. Yeah, so tier one extractor. Uh-huh. Of course you do. This aluminum is killing me. Yeah, see, because we have so much power, so much solar everywhere, and it's not enough. We need to get into the nuclears, but we need to get an explosive powder and we have not found any yet so realistically i'm gonna have to make one but to make one i need that one i think i need to launch some rockets for heat so that i can throw down my first biodome i think that's my issue all right so let's go silicon two magnesium two all right fly over here and slap down two more solars real quick and hopefully hopefully that's enough see why does it do that okay that does put our power positive okay so at this point we have one drill doing aluminum we have one aluminum drill I think I need Six. That's enough for six more. What do I have in my inventory that I don't need? Get that iridium out of here. Right before six. Yeah, I think what I want to do is I want to launch a couple rockets. I have the tier four oxygen, right? I do. Okay. All right, I need three more titanium. Ooh, not that many. Just three, please. All right. We're going to go U3. And then I need cobalt. Um, 
If I do two, I can launch two rockets. Okay. Like that. Yes, that should be enough to launch two rockets. Hi. Okay, that should be enough to launch two of these rockets. I can go F2 to get a shot. Look at that. Cool. Gonna give that a try and see if I remember. All right, so that gives me two. That'll get me a bunch of uranium, which we need. Ooh, something went blah boom. Uh, food water, dump you, cobalt, dump you. So the, the two options are we either go exploring more to try to get those resources that we're short on, or we have to mine it. And the drill we have is kind of slow. So we'll have to just kind of play it by ear. Um, let's fly out to that wreck there and see if there's any more goodies there. I don't think there is. I think we brought it all in. You know what? Let's do this. Let's just do a round of resource collecting while we're waiting for all of the meteors to come down. Because we just spent a bunch of resources. Let's replenish some of that. Yeah. Ooh, lag. And then my concern is, like, we're going to get those resources in, and then... We'll get all the uranium that just hit down. We did need to increase our heat, so that'll help a lot with the with the heat, because we just got 2,000% on heat. Because if we can get the biodome to... Hello. Hello. There we go. Yeah. Titanium. There's a kitty. Handsome. Where you at? Hi. Heart. That tummy. How can you say no to that tummy? It's very hard. Let's say that's not a that's not a rock. One of the things that um I was gonna say one of the things I'm kinda hesitant on is some of the some of the resources that we're gathering are kind of just slow to accumulate. What do you need? Twelve? That's trickling in. It is getting there. Oxygen plants, a flower spreader takes a fertilizer. We have the algae one, which will give us plants. Give us a little bit of oxygen energy 13. We have 15 available. We need plants to get the bio lab. Okay. So essentially, just pick one is what it's telling me. Pick pick anything we can get our hands on to produce, and we'll make it work. All right, you come here. Hey. Do we want to dedicate one point nineteen? That's nine. But it takes a fertilizer, which we don't have access to. We'd have to find it. The other option. Sorry, I'm petting a cat. The other option here for plants would be to get biodome, which we're at two out of 12, two and a half out of 12. So we either launch more rockets to get the heat going, or we have to focus on dumping at least one item. So I had nine things pop up on my phone all at the same time and they all buzz and that's, that's, that's done. That's done. Let's put away. Okay. 
<clears throat> so. Usually, when I play, my first item for this usually ends up being the biodome. Which, my options are either to go find super. Let's do those two. Yeah, usually my options are to go find super or something to that effect. Because we'd have to scale up the pieces we're missing. I was about to say, do we have any... Not that I can see. Is there a render distance in the options? Options, graphics. Our graphic quality is high. <clears throat> right, nice graphic quality, full screen. Yeah, nothing there that's too useful at the moment, sadly. Ooh. Hunt down some more silicon. We're currently more than full on iron, so we're going to ignore the iron temporarily. There's some uranium over there. Might be some right here next to me, too. There's rubble. Hmm. Ooh, yep, there we go. I had a feeling. Got it. All righty. I definitely want to get a couple other games running at some point. The problem is I have just a bajillion different games I want to have all at the same time. <laughs> but at that point, I'd have one video posting from like four different games every day. But who knows? That might be the way to do it, really. Okay. Uno Sulfaro. Reckon. All right, let's go visit this one, which, if I remember right, is empty. Yeah, that one's empty. Oop. All right. All right, so we need to hunt down any uranium we can, which I can already see there's a bunch right there. Bring all this uranium home. Get that going. We need the uranium for the rockets, and we were just about out, which is good that we launched some. <laughs> Excuse me. Nothing over there. Ooh, chest still. I think this is empty. It's not empty. What the heck? How long has that been there? Ooh, hello. All right. I feel bad because I initially started recording the Wildlands and my mic was messed up, so it's a little blown out. Which is annoying because it greatly reduces the quality. Um, what I found from watching it myself is if I turn the volume down, the blowout isn't nearly as bad. <coughs> but that's still annoying because it shouldn't have been there in the first place. Oh, right. Base. <laughs> I literally was like, huh, I see things. There's color. And then I looked down, and it's like, oh, it's a base. Totally forgot that was there. It's going to be a nice surprise. Every single time I pop in, I'm going to be like, oh, look, there's stuff under here. The one bad thing, though, is now I can't gain any oxygen for it. Um, near my home, there's actually a massive um, solar panel farm uh, a couple hours from my house, but we saw it the other day when we went out on an adventure, and it was like, whoa. Oh boy, this was multiple, it looks like, the hit right here. All right, let's get all these goodies home and head back for another round. Take one down, pass it around. I'm getting my caffeine intake done early today, so that way it's out of my system by the time I have to sleep. Okay. Tons of uranium. Um, one chip. <laughs> Fence, so glad. 
it's kind of one of those necessary evil moments where you're like, in order to get something better, I have to get rid of this one. Dump everything, pull that out, pull the food out. Food. Sulfur. Okay. All right. Ooh, there's some right over there, too. I see it. A gentle glow. Oh, you know, I think having more night cycles would be kind of fun in this game or longer night cycles. Because the night cycle is literally like less than 60 seconds. Like by the time you realize it's dark, it's already getting light again. I don't know why, but this patch of water right here generally catches a couple. Nope, none at the moment. Yeah. Ooh, we have four drills. I thought we had less. We have four drills. Okay, so we need four more. Any glowies in here? It would also be nice if they did a visual update that made it so you could see through the water more if there was like glowy stuff inside. Oh my gosh, there's one way over there. <laughs> Hello. Wow, there's two tucked in here. I hug the lip and see if there's any up on the lip here. The answer is <coughs> the answer is cough. <coughs> Pardon me. I'm at the tail end of still being sick. Which hopefully we'll get to get rid of at some point. It's just one of those moments of how long can you be kind of sick? Because at some point you really want it to be gone. Ooh. Hello, what happened here? What a strange spot for that to hit. But yeah, that's a full inventory of uranium there. Okay, so at the moment, our two biggest needs is aluminum and super. And super, we don't have a lot of options for super yet. We can't mine super till a tier two drill. I think I need to head in there and see if there's any more super available. Dump the uranium. Should have, um... See, because realistically, if we can get one explosive powder, we can get one there. Oh, uh, food growers, aluminum. We used all the aluminum. Okay, yeah, we need aluminum and super desperately. So let's go visit the spot in there for a minute, see if we have either. I want to say we had some aluminum in there, maybe even some super that got left behind on our last journey in. So let's go check on those boys. I can also hop around the uh, ridges and pick up any super that I missed, because there should still be quite a bit. Jump! All right. There's one over there. Ha ha! That was a very big jump. I know because my toes caught on the edge and I went... <gasps> <laughs> Trying to decide if I was going to fall to my death or not. There we go. Chest down there. Okay, that's five. Super. No more on that side. Just one over here. Ooh, one right there. Nothing in the nook. About over here. Oh, yes. At least one more. Oh, two more. Hello, boys. Also another chest. Is there any more visible super? Not nearby. Okay, let's head down because there were two chests here. 
That was one chip. I want to say it's over here. Yeah. Two chips and some super. Good, good. Now I was just thinking, I don't know if there's any... Excuse me. I don't know if there's any... Um, ooh, aluminum. Ooh, Nelly Ba. There's more aluminum in here. That's a dead end. I keep ah, I'm dusting myself to no end. <laughs> There's also aluminum all over in here, so I really need to come back and just do like an aluminum run on the bottom and just pick up whatever I can. Get some oxy. Okay. There's this show that my work has been obsessed with. It's called Murder Comes to Town. It's about a bunch of little cities dealing with like really crazy murders and stuff. And a couple of them have been pretty wild. Most of them are drug related, which makes sense because, you know, people do all kinds of crazy for drugs. All right, we have Iridium. Let's pick up all that Iridium and do, yeah, that number. Dump you, grab you make one of you dump dump water sorry my brain went to that because i said oxy earlier and one of the episodes was about oxy cotton it's like this is such a nice family why would why would someone want to kill them and then it's like oh they were illegally selling oxy cotton <laughs> no wonder <laughs> it's like they did something stupid all right I think we want some food growers officially. So let's grab three water. Iron. <clears throat> Pardon me. One. Oh no, these are power hungry. I forgot. Shoot. That is not good. I also only have one. <laughs> I still only have one seed to grow, so I guess that works out because I don't have any resources for it. See, this is one of the reasons why I was kind of aiming more towards launching rockets versus more into like launch, blah, 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 launching rockets instead of um, expanding the stuff because the power demands is killing me the the aluminum demand is so hard right now because absolutely everything requires aluminum and we don't have enough aluminum our world isn't hot enough to melt all of the osmium locations then osmium is going to be killer too I'm, I, that's one of the reasons why i'm trying to rocket our way to the tier two um uh the tier two extractors because then we can throw down super and osmium Ooh. yeah we'll be able to throw down a super drill an osmium drill because those are the two primary resources we're going to need that we don't have the problem is i just realized i'm pretty sure one of those requires the osmium or the the super rod so to even get to that point we're going to need the we need that rod, which we don't have access to. What is over here? Oh. Coming into there from a different angle than I'm used to. Aluminum. Luckily, there's all these close by locations to like pick up some resources and stuff. Let's go up there and visit that and see. Oh man, this is blown out. It is so bright. What do you got for me? Hey, two food seeds. That's good. Two food seeds. We'll happily take those. What do I have? Iron. 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 Titanium. I need one more titanium. Come 
Come on, give me one titanium. Yeah, I want to go over there to the osmium. But I need one more titanium so I can throw down a building. Look at all these resources out here. Oh my goodness. Oh, not iron. That one. And I don't want to fill up my inventory because I'm about to go down into a cave. There's some more osmium here and I'm going to need that for the drills. I'm pretty sure the tier 2 takes the super rod. So that's going to be a um, temporary bottleneck. Until we can unlock it. All right. Some sulfur, some osmium. See, these caves are interesting because they only partially open. Which means you get some resource, but not all. See, it still goes deeper, but that's as far as we get. We get four osmium. We only get four osmium to start with, so. Oh, interesting colors. I have a purple there for a minute. All right, and then that's the top of the Mesa. The goal was to play as have the Mesa be one of my starting locations, but then I realized it would be insanely annoying to play. <laughs> like it would be absolutely stupid to play. And we'll see. I might I might still try to do something in that area, but we'll we'll see how how much and how involved I want to get on that one. Uh, the main issue is just trying to launch rockets or call in meteors to that location would really be horrific because anything that lands above you, you basically can't get to or you have to build, spend a lot of iron to build like elaborate ways to it. Where's the chest over here? Where's the chest at? There's supposed to be a chest right here. Did I already get it earlier? I didn't think I did. I don't remember coming out to this sp spot right right here. Hmm. Maybe I already grabbed it. There's usually one or... Oh, there's one of them. I could have sworn there was two chests right over here. Ooh. Okay. Dump the fabric and the iron, because those are worthless at the moment. Neither of those have any use. The pestras have no use either. The uranium is the most valuable. All right, let's take that much for now. And let's head home. I have food. I don't have water. Hmm, there's an aluminum out here. I thought I had scoured all the aluminum. Any other? Just that one. It just looks like that one. How's this drill doing? Oof. One aluminum. Oh, baby. That sucks. Hydration level low. <laughs> right. <laughs> you ain't just whistling Dixie. All right. We got a handful of aluminum, which is good. We got a, a few. Wow. We actually have a decent amount of super for once. That's wild. A ton of sulfur and osmium. Yeah, we're up to five osmium, which is awesome. Definitely going to need that. And then we have a ton of seeds here. Um, and then some food. Let's eat a little food. And then... Lerma. Okay. Alright, so as of the moment, I think what I want... Let's do this. Yeah, we're going to get five more rockets launched really quick for heat. F2. Yeah, baby. F2. All right, that gives me five more. Oh, five more rockets. Oh. I just realized that there's super right there that I never picked up. I don't know why we can't see it, 